everyone welcome back to my channel so today's video i am obviously going to be talking about the title so i failed out of nursing school um or like quote unquote failed out of nursing school so i'm gonna explain what happened yeah i don't want this video to be sad or anything i'm not gonna be crying i just want to talk about what happened and like my journey bouncing back from everything so in the fall of 2017 which is my junior year of college i started nursing school and just to give a recap of myself hi my name's tamar if you're new here um and i went to lamar university and i played volleyball and so being a nursing student one if you're watching this video and you're a nursing student you know how hard it is and being a full-time student athlete was probably one of the hardest things to balance i think also because i started nursing school in the fall and if you don't know volleyball is in season in the fall so we were like traveling and everything and it just made it really difficult for me to adjust to the lifestyle and for me to form study groups things like that um so i started nursing school and that was also the summer that hurricane harvey hit so the first two weeks of school i think were postponed and we were doing assignments online um season obviously had started so i was on the road almost every single week i was getting four hour lectures emailed to me i was having to go pick out my patients um, before practice and after practice and having to finish care plans go to clinicals come back practice pack for our road trip study on the bus all of that so it was just really really hard for me to balance the two and i ended up getting two d's in my classes and if you don't know a d in nursing school is a 70 to a 74 and a c in nursing school is a 75 to a 79 and i ended up making like a 72 in one of my classes and in the other class i have no idea that was another story um and yeah so i got two d's in my classes so i didn't technically fail but i failed and so that Christmas break was really hard for me because I am someone who's always taken school very seriously. I like I've taken my academics very seriously since I was a little and my friends used to make fun of me for it because I was just so like set on making like all A's and like I mean obviously as I got older making all A's was really hard um so it wasn't that big of a deal to me anymore but I still took my academics seriously like I wanted to set myself up for success I'm not someone who was street smart growing up so my my academics was my way to success I have friends who are very street smart and are doing great for themselves and I'm extremely happy for them but that was just not my avenue for life so um to have something that I've always taken very seriously for something that's always been pretty stable um was really hard for me to accept the fact that i was a failure or that i wasn't good enough or i just like i was embarrassed to tell family members like i was just embarrassed to talk about it i didn't want to share it at all i honestly wasn't even going to talk about like this on my channel but it's i've thought about it before and it's been growing on me the past couple of weeks because I'm in nursing school again. It's really hard to get into another nursing school once you failed out somewhere else because they just assume that you're not going to be able to be successful in their school and I'm not going to use me being a student athlete as a crutch for me to get in somewhere else because at the end of the day I failed out and no one really cares if I was an athlete or not. So um but it took me a while to bounce back and i don't want to say i was depressed but it was really hard for me and i was really sad for a really long time i didn't want to talk about it um the thought of it or like when people would bring it up and ask me what i'm gonna do next if i'm gonna go somewhere else it would just put me in like a really dark place and i would get either really angry or really sad um and i just I took it really hard after trying multiple places i went so many places i contacted so many places was trying to figure out where i'm gonna go what i'm gonna do because i was really set on finishing nursing school what the day i committed to lamar i made sure i told my coach that school was a big priority for me and i like plan on doing nursing so volleyball like is not my number one priority once i'm in nursing school um but obviously having to balance the two is just really 
difficult especially when you have your athletic advisor and you have your um, academic advisor and they don't communicate so you have to be the middleman and it just makes it really really hard um so yeah but this video i don't want to discourage anyone from pursuing nursing or anything in medicine because I think that it's a great profession and I think that it is doable if you have the resources, if you have the support. I definitely think that it is possible. So don't be discouraged by my video at all. I don't want this to be a sad or discouraging video because I made it. I was able to make it from one place into another and for that to come from me, I am a very determined person but I'm also a very negative person. I am the type of person that's like, I'm probably going to fail this test. So once I do fail the test, I'm not as upset as I could have been. And I'm trying to get out of that mentality. I'm trying to view life in a different way. I am trying to be a more positive person. I am trying to find my own intrinsic motivation for the things that I like to do. And this making videos have been a great creative outlet for me, for me to share fashion advice and things that i love and for me to like get all dolled up i love makeup i love clothes i love getting dressed up i love wearing good pair of heels i love shopping i love stuff like that but i also am very passionate about helping people and giving back and um nursing will allow me to do that i don't know how i'm gonna balance the two don't ask me but i'm gonna make it work because this is just something that makes me happy and I just want anyone else who may be struggling, anyone else who may not be on the path that they originally set out for themselves because I, at this point in my life, being 22, planned on working in a hospital or working in my profession somewhere, living on my own, doing all of that stuff. And obviously, I'm not in that position right now. And it took me a really long time to accept that. It's really hard to come from being independent in college and then come home and stay with your parents and be dependent again but i'm learning to accept my circumstances and i am just going to continue to work to where i want to be because if i continue to sit and be a sap i'm never going to make it out of my current situation so if you're in the same position as me if you are struggling or if you failed something and you're trying to figure out how to bounce back um if you are just struggling with finding your own motivation let this be the fire that i'm lighting under your butt right now to get after the things that you want to do because coming from me being the negative nancy that i am um a lot of people who are watching this video are probably like who tomorrow who? um but yeah i just want to make a change in my lifestyle in the way that i i just want to change my perspective and there are so many people who have helped me get to where i am i honestly don't think i would have survived the whole debacle of me failing out if it wasn't for my family mr g michelle emlyn my teammates anyone any one of those people who are watching this video i love you guys thank you guys so much jonathan like i would not be where i am and in the headspace that i'm at right now at this point if it wasn't for those people and if you don't have the support that you need if you are just like alone and you feel alone please don't hesitate to contact me, like DM me, comment under this video, whatever. I would not mind being that support for somewhere else, someone else because I know other people don't have as much support as I do. Um, and so I really wanted to share this because this is something that I've been embarrassed about for so long and I'm tired of being embarrassed about it. I'm tired of hiding why I'm in school or where I'm going to school. I mean, I don't want to share where I'm going to school because it's so small right now. Maybe later on I'll share where I'm going to school, but I am in nursing school and I'm working towards getting my BSN and I'm really happy about it and I'm excited and where I'm going, I am just beyond blessed because the atmosphere is just so much different than the first time I was in nursing school so yeah i don't know if this was helpful if it was please comment and let me know because then i just be like 
putting all my business out there to a camera and no one cares um but i've been trying to be more positive and i've been sharing a lot more positive things on my instagram so if you guys aren't following me on there definitely follow me on there i've been sharing i share bible verses i share you know just my perspective things that i've not been successful in um and i'm trying to be more open with those things so don't hesitate to follow me subscribe if you're new and this video was helpful to you in any way thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in my next video